Day six. 皆さんこんにちは。It's Rina and welcome back to the three minutes abs challenge. We are on day six today of this one week three minutes abs challenge. Yesterday we did knees in plank and I heard from a couple of people that they couldn't hold in the plank for three minutes because that's also a good workout for you. Shoulders and arms. But I think even if you can't do it from the beginning, that's totally fine. Just try to keep doing constantly and you can start from like 30 seconds or one minute. And once you can do this, then you can move into one minute and 30 seconds, two minutes, and then eventually you'll be able to do three minutes. So just don't give up and keep it up. Today we're gonna do bicycle crunch. So basically we're gonna lay down on the mat or on the bed and We're just gonna crunch this part. By the way, the balloon behind me, it's my birthday balloons from the K pop workshop. I personally hosted a free workshop for my most favorite K pop songs, and a lot of people actually joined me. So, thank you guys if you're watching this video, and I really like the balloons and your present. All right, without any further ado, let's get started. All right, so today's bicycle crunch, we actually have three options from level one to three. So I'm g o i n g to introduce you guys first, and you can pick whatever you can hold for three minutes. All right, so first, everyone, we're g o i n g to lay down on the mat, looking up at the ceiling, and we're just g o i n g to simply take one into the chest and switch. And switch. When you extend your legs, make sure your heels are off the mat. Don't touch your legs down like this, but keep it up. And if you feel that this is really easy, then you can extend your arms and take your head and the shoulders off the mat and crunch. Leg switch. Now, option three is you can put your hands behind your head. You're gonna twist your upper body as well, like this. Try to put your right elbow to the left knee and vice versa. Three, two, one, go! All right, let's begin. Try to keep your pelvis position stable and then move your legs using your inner abs. Here we go. Try to not rely on your lower back because it's gonna get hard. But control the entire body throughout your abs. Here we go. And if it's easy for you, you can take your hands off the mat and switch your legs. Here we go. Now, if your neck is getting tired, you can put your hands behind your head. You can hold it like this. Here we go, keeping it up. Make sure you keep breathing. Inhale and exhale, just like this. Now, I think a lot of people have a question about which exercise you should do, either aerobic or anaerobic. Or how. So, aerobic exercise is the exercise that you take lots of oxygen inside of your body, such as swimming, running, dancing, jogging, things like that. And those exercises burn fat, whereas anaerobic exercise is like more the gym workout, weightlifting, strengthening muscles, something like that. And those use s your glucose as an energy. So, if you are considering to lose fat and lose weight and burn fat, then I would suggest to do a anaerobic exercise first, which is like weightlifting or training. Because by doing anaerobic exercise,、um, your body secretes lots of adrenaline and growth hormone. Which increases the basal metabolism and it does help you to burn fat much more efficiently. But on the other hand, if you are, for instance, running 5k or 10k and you want to just simply increase your breathing capacity, then you can do aerobic exercise first. But also, if you are already skinny or don't have so much fat to lose, but you just want to simply Gain more muscles, then I would suggest to do、uh, aerobic exercise more because I don't think anaerobic, sorry, anaerobic exercise like muscle strength and exercise because 
aerobic exercise like cardio workout is not necessarily so much for you. But yeah, it depends on your body and your fitness goal and then choosing the best workout routine is really good for your body. Here we go. Finish! That's a wrap! Alright, good job guys. Now put your abs on the mat and stretch that part. Alright, beautiful work. Alright, beautiful work guys. Today's three minutes was kind of faster than yesterday. At least I feel it for me. Anyways, when I was a little bit chubbier, I was kind of hesitant to do any weightlifting or equipment workout because I believe that my body is going to get bigger and I didn't like that. But after I studied and researched about my body, I found out that anaerobic exercise won't let your body bigger but strengthen your muscles and lose fat as well. So I started working out every day as well as since I'm a fitness instructor, I've been teaching dance and fitness classes, doing cardio exercise. And then I've been getting in the shape better than a couple of years ago. But I understand that there are so many type of people, so many type of body structure in this world. So choosing the best way to work out that's suitable and fit your body is the best and if you have any questions or concern about your body you can feel free to leave some comments and i would like to give you some advice or suggestions with my knowledge all right thank you guys so much for watching this video and working out with me we just finished day six today and we have one more day left but i believe in you guys because we came here on day six so let's keep it up and we're gonna do one more workout for your abs tomorrow. If you like today's exercise or if you enjoyed this 3 minutes abs challenge for one week, please don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe my channel and see you guys tomorrow. Matane!